Hello, happy Monday. Welcome to another Angel Message Monday. And this week we have a new moon. It's this beautiful new moon in Aries. So think about new intentions that you want to set. It's a really adventurous and spontaneous time. So think about, do you want to take small risk and intention setting sort of eh action and being spontaneous? Are you ready for something big? And then align that with positions one, two, or three. Oop, press pause if you need more time. And let's see what you get. I'm gonna go ahead and shuffle the cards three times and we'll see what shows up. So if you are choosing position number one, be independent. Be independent and trust your own knowing. The card you get is the High Priestess, which is also about trusting your own knowing. Now, if you're choosing this position, remember that Aries really loves to be adventurous and spontaneous. So what can you do to be as you are? The the High Priestess, I will say too, there's a sense of the High Priestess where she doesn't necessarily leap. She allows people to come to her. Look at her, she's just standing there, arms wide open with her knowledge that she has read out of that book that she is holding. And she's ready maybe for a, something a little bit different, something um, that's a little bit of a change. Again, adventure, spontaneous. So what can you do this week to think about? Um, and we're still technically in a waning, we're eliminating and decreasing, so you can still get rid of in order to make space for being there, being present, and begin to intend for and plan spontaneity and change. So what can you do? Look at her, she's standing there with her eyes and arms, her heart wide open. So this is a really good time to really discover the benefits of being ourselves and expressing ourselves with authenticity, especially if you're choosing this position. And what I'll finally say about this is think very, very mindfully before you take action or maybe even speak. If you're choosing position number two and you're ready to like, kind of like, eh, maybe, maybe you get the dreamer. So we know that you are ready to leap. It is in there. So set intentions around dreaming. If you're choosing this position, I want to say really commit to your personal goals. Commit to your personal goals that are going to help you to um, hone in on your positive qualities and which you bring to life. The dreamer is a card that represents us when we are ready to journey into something new, when we are ready to take charge of our lives, right? And you think about Aries, the ram, taking charge. So what is it that you can do? Notice where your eye goes to on this card. My eye tends to go right here to the unicorn, which tells me to really envision what I want in terms of a brand new project. Um, so be assertive, be confident. This is a really beautiful time for you. Take charge, discover your, your leaping courage, your bravery in that and move forward. So set some new intentions around that. And finally, if you're choosing position number three, the card you get is contentment for a fire. It is peace. Now, because Aries is the very first sign of the Zodiac, um, there's a lot of opportunity and there's a lot of new beginnings. So it's a really good time to follow a hunch or um, you know, take a risk right now to be adventurous, as I said, to go with that impulse. And this position is saying, you're fine to do that. You are successful, you are content, you are grounded. Everything you need is provided for. So really be in that peace, feel the abundance and um, really acknowledge and honor and be grateful for that home life that you have too. It is happy, it is peaceful, even if you don't feel that. And I'm gonna choose a support card for this position. <laughs> you get the four of fire again and you saw me shuffle. That's wild. So it's a double message of abundance and being satisfied, be satiated, be happy with where you are. Um, and then set intentions to um, take where you are and expand on it and be adventurous and go big. Um, go big and be home. <laughs> Not go big or go home. Go big and be home. You know, just really relishing and loving in all that you have and all that you've created. I'm sending you so much love. Have a peaceful, loving new moon week going into the new moon.